Okay, so this is the model box from Make Magazine, issue 34 on page 100. Uh, as you can see, I've got it in my own personalized little case here. It's just a small box I picked up from a craft store. And, uh, you know, some hardware here, metal screen, the speakers in there, of course, um, jack, and then the switch. So, um, and inside, of course, is the, uh, all the electronics, the circuit board, all that fun stuff. I got another video you can see that in though. This is just made to show you the uh, you know finished product. So I turn this on and I go back to my iPod here and I start playing some songs. There we go. Okay, so you can see it sounds pretty w pretty nice. Um, I've noticed on some higher bass songs it gets a little fuzzy. I'll find some uh, pretty heavy bass song here. Let's see. Oh, here we go. It's a little fuzzy. Okay, so you can see it's, it plays a lot, it plays a variety of music pretty well. Uh, let's see if I can just pick up some rock songs here. Let's see what's a good one here. Uh, okay, here. This is a good example of bass. <laughs> So you can notice it sounded a little crackly there. That's the uh, bass from the speaker. I'm not sure if that might be the circuit as well. I don't have many other speakers to test it with. Um, it could be my speaker, it could be the circuit. Who knows, really. Um, it's up to you to plug it in and find out. But um, so far, like all my music plays pretty well through these speakers. Like I've had very little issue with any uh, particular type. Uh, I noticed classical music sounds pretty nice through it. If I just pick out one of those. There we go. So you can see it plays a variety of music quite well. Um, but yeah, it's really up to you. I mean, the best way to test it out is for you to build it yourself. It costs about 10 bucks, really, total parts. And about two days worth to build it. Anyway, so uh, that's all. Thanks for watching this video. And uh, leave any comments, questions, concerns you might have in the comments section. Alright.